A tearful tribute tonight for a woman who was killed in a deadly dog dispute. It all started when her dog got out. And when it was returned, two strangers claimed that the dog was theirs. That led to this fatal argument. Local 10 News reporter Roy Ramos, he's live in Miami Gardens with our top story. Andrew and Alex's family absolutely devastated. They say that that grandmother made it inside of her door right here, where you can see those candles lit when those shots were fired. They now want justice. Sister Danette bothered no one. Amen. Family, friends, and loved ones gathered outside the home of 63-year-old Danette D.D. Simmons for a candlelight vigil after Miami Gardens police said she was gunned down inside her home late Thursday night. She played a big role in everybody's life, and it's, it's sad. It's sad. While candles now light up an image of Dee Dee placed on her front door, those closest to her remembered the woman who they described as selfless and loving. She was a woman of God first. She was a auntie, grandma, stepma, friend. While investigators are still searching for her killer, family members we spoke with say it was just before midnight when her dog Chase had gotten loose. As Dee Dee's neighbor came to return the small Yorkie, they said two strangers showed up to the home claiming the dog was theirs. They say there was a fight and shots were fired. This is her dog. Like, so how can you take someone's life over their stuff? Like, I just don't understand. <laughs> As family and friends now mourn the loss of their beloved Dee Dee, her granddaughter's message to the killer that remains on the loose. Turn yourself in. Like, y'all don't know what y'all did to our family.